Yeah, it was it was uh, really good. Um, I thought we had some good defensive sets. Uh, we had a three-minute block there on the goal line, which we um, kept them out. And then obviously in the second half, uh, those reset scrums and making the changes um, made a huge difference to us. And I mean, it's it's a massive gain for us when we on our own goal line defending and we get a turnover or we get a free kick. Um, you know, it's just it just lifts lifts everyone. Um, I thought towards the end of the game, the last seven and a half minutes, um, that was probably for me our best defensive efforts. Um, it's just because we were just going after the ball and and trying to get that bonus point um, or <clears throat> bonus point back for us. So, yeah, that was that was pretty much. Um, a good defensive set and efforts, and it's coming coming together nicely. Um, but another test on the weekend, um, and hopefully we can just crack on from where we left off. Um, look, uh, we've got if our internationals are back, um, and we have them on the pitch, we have all uh, you know the whole. I think we've got seven poachers um, in the team which makes it massive for us and it changes the opposition's thinking and now they can't just clean with two guys but they they need to clean with three or maybe four guys which is which is massive for us um i think re the referees interpret it differently and it's how we adapt on the day to 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 the specific referee um but you know we are hard at that we are hard at the players making the right decisions um if i just think of my head now last weekend we conceded a penalty for not not rolling away you know that we've been drilling that we can't just lie there once we've made the tackle we need to go um to the side as quick as we can so those things we're hard at and we know the referees are going to pick up on that you know they it is trying to trying to improve the attacking play and the first place to do that is the the breakdown so um no we've i think we've adapted really well um but again, last weekend, um, not just at the breakdown in other areas, um, our discipline did let us down. So uh, we we hard at work on that, and um, it's just a continual work on. Yeah, definitely, Trevor. Um, it's a massive game for for them. They will be raring to go, uh, especially after the loss up in the sports ground uh, sports ground against Connacht. And um, you know, die young. Uh, back on his old stomping ground, um, trying to instill pride back into that blue jersey. So um, it's going to be a massive game for them. It's going to be a massive game for us. Like you said, trying to um, keep our our uh, our points ticking over and, and just keeping our lead um, in our pool. Um, but for them, they've got uh, Europe uh, at stake as well. So um, I know it's going to be a massive game. Um, and uh, we're looking, we're absolutely looking forward to it. Anytime you get to play a game at the moment, it's very exciting. Uh, it was great to get out there and play 50 minutes and kind of feel that contact, that live contact and get used to it. And hopefully get more minutes under my belt this weekend. It was tough at the start. Um, to be honest, it's only kind of in the last year or so that I've properly felt myself. Um, I think after being out for so long, for 15 months, Kind of getting back into the speed of things was tough, but um, it is a tough road. But um, yeah, it took it took a long time, just even like scrum wise and things like that, getting used to it. Because the period I was out to scrum, I kind of changed the laws and the calls, so I was getting up to speed with things like that. So um, took a bit of learning and a bit of practice, but got there in the end. You're always looking to play every weekend, and with especially myself, I would have played a lot of AL coming through, and that's a great kind of. That's where it kind of got me to where I am with Munster. So um, it's kind of disappointing not being able to fall back and play in the club games or not as many A games. But um, the standard of training and things like that so well that um, we're kind of keeping up the pace that way. We're expecting a big, we're a big, big game. They're pushing for a European spot. Um, they had a defeat last week. They're back in Cardiff Farmers Park this weekend. So um, they're dangerous. They have dangerous midfield. They're dangerous out wide. So. Um, they'll be raring to go.